Hey fans and subscribers, this is your host Joe, and this is a video on what updates are coming on Armory Crate SE version 1.3.6. And if you are interested in reading about those updates, I will provide the link in the description for those. But for this video, I'm going to be going through those updates for you to see. The first step we want to do is to upgrade Armory Crate to version 1.3.6. We need to open Armory Crate. We need to go to Content. We need to then go to Update Center. And you will select Check for Updates. And you will see available the Armory Crate SE.core 1.3.6.0. We are going to select update. We are prompted to update Armory Crate and we will select update now. And Armory Crate is going to update. Once the update finishes, we have the option to launch Armory Crate or launch it later. Let's go ahead and launch Armory Crate. The Armory Crate installer is going to load, so we will give that a moment. All right, and we have the new version 1.3.6 loaded for Armory Crate, and we are already given a prompt here for the Where Is My Ally campaign. And we can select I'm interested or not now to potentially go ahead and engage or engage later. I'm going to go ahead and select not now. Let's start with a new feature that is added in Armory Crate, and that function is a remove button function in key mapping. So let's access the key mapping section. Let's go to settings under control mode configure. And then in gamepad mode, we will go to gamepad mode. We will select configure in this case, and we will be brought up to key mapping. And this is going to be familiar to you as this was already available in previous versions of Armory Crate. So for an example, let's just pick one of these. Let's pick the View button. And let's click there. And as you can see, there is a Remove function that is on the bottom side of the screen. That's going to be on the right-hand side. And as you can see, the primary button by default right now is view, but we can remove this if we want. We can select or press X. And as you see, the view button was cleared, and now we have an unassigned button. We can select. And again, this is what is familiar to previous versions, so we have some options here on what we would like to have that button be. Now, in the case that you clear this by accident, what you can do is you can select reset to default and you're going to get that view button. Next, a new feature that was added to the Armory Crate command center is the battery level, Wi-Fi status, and current system time. And those are going to be available up here for you to see. The next feature that is part of the update is adding the 5 gigabyte, 6 gigabyte, and 7 gigabyte options to memory assigned to GPU settings. To access that area, let's go to settings, let's go to operating mode, let's go to GPU settings, and this is already familiar to you. However, there are more options this time. You can see that I have the 6 gigabyte selected as my allocated VRAM. So if we click here, we have all the way from one to eight. So this is going to reflect what is already, what already has been in the BIOS to select. The next two features I would like to show you is a new feature for the addition of Where Is My Ally giveaway campaign and a new feature that adds the ROG official Ally tutorial YouTube playlist in the Help Center. To access that area, let's select Content. And you can see immediately the campaign details here that can be clicked on. Though for the tutorial page, we can access Help Center. And as you can see already, there's a guided tour area. And you can click on these videos. You can play all of them. Though for an example, we can just click on this one here. And through YouTube, we are already playing one of the videos.
The next new feature I will share with you is an added icon for Xbox Cloud Gaming in Game Platform section. That is this section that you see. And you see here the Xbox Cloud Gaming. That is an option available within these. So this is not going to be added automatically for you to see. So you will need to go to Content. You will need to go to Game Platforms. And now you are going to see the Xbox Cloud Gaming. If you click this icon, I've already done this and follow through with the steps, but if you click this icon, you are going to be prompted to download or open the Xbox Cloud Gaming application. You may then be prompted to sign in. And what should happen is we go back, we should go ahead and already see the Xbox Cloud Gaming icon here. However, I needed to close out Armory Crate and open Armory Crate back up and then select Sort By to see this icon. It was not readily made available to select just upon following those steps. All right, and that is our video on the new version 1.3.6 update for Armory Crate that is released as of August 7th. 2023. There is one feature that I do want to provide you the details for that was not in the earlier part of this video. It is rather an enhancement. It is the addition of a confirmation pop-up window for the command center's in-task function. I hope this video helps you with the new version that has been made available. I look forward to reading your comments in the description. And with that, I will leave you now with the words of Commander Shepard from Mass Effect. I should go.